Tomorrow we'll get a fresh round of jobless numbers since the pandemic began. More than 40 million people have lost their jobs. Economists are predicting another 1.8 million Americans filed first time applications for unemployment last week. Here in North Carolina, more than 300,000 people are out of work and still waiting for their unemployment checks. Some have waited for months. New at six, the defenders Nate Morabito is asking, where's the money? 14 days after an initial claim. That's how long the state expects it to take people to receive their first unemployment benefit when there are no other issues. But federal data show even before COVID-19, no other state struggled as much as North Carolina. It's been devastating for me. This is the face of desperation. I got laid off on March 6th. Out of work for more than two months, Shaquana Burgess is now out of money and her $1,100 rent is due any day. I still have bills. I maxed up my credit cards. I've used up my savings. Um, it's just hard. The Charlotte woman says she filed for unemployment back in March, but like so many others, encountered problem after problem with the North Carolina Division of Employment Security. When you have to call numerous times and just can't get through. Welcome to the Department of Commerce or it hangs up on you and you have to call back in the queue. It's, it's just been extremely stressful because you don't know if you're gonna get payment. While she struggled, the agency added staff to help handle claims on April 3rd. About a month after she filed for unemployment, the state tripled its employees to meet the unprecedented surge in unemployment claims. But records show by then, people had already filed more than 636,000 claims, meaning roughly half of all claims to date came in that first month. I would have liked to have seen the changes made faster. Representative Chaz Beasley has family members facing unemployment uncertainty too and has called on their behalf. I know personally how frustrating it can be when you don't know if you're sending that email, if someone's gonna get back to you or if you're making that call, someone's gonna get back to you. He says the system is so stressed, even legislators are having trouble getting results for their constituents. That's sad, I wish that we could say that we could wave a magic wand and get this thing fixed immediately, um, but we want people to get their benefits and get them to them quickly, so we want to be honest. Amid mounting pressure, the governor changed the agency's leadership last week. I want to make sure those benefits get into the hands of those people as quickly as possible. But federal data show unemployment delays are nothing new. In fact, at the end of 2019, North Carolina received the worst performance rating in the country for fulfilling first payments within 14 to 21 days. It's improved slightly in the first three months of this year, but the state is still at the very bottom. I talked to the right person, got transferred to a higher tier. I was able to receive it um, right before rent was due. Just in time. It was a long time coming. A Department of Commerce spokesperson told me while a claim with no problems usually takes 14 days or less, every claim is different and suggested now that there are two types of unemployment benefits, state and pandemic, determining eligibility is somewhat more complicated and more time consuming. Nate Morabito, WCNC Charlotte.